YouTube, YouTube. It's Grits Kicks, man. I'm back in the building, you. Hey, bro, I'm back, man. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, man. Happy Friday, you feel me? I know y'all boys about to get out there and you feel me? Get to shaking it up, man. It's Wednesday, it's the weekend, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all trying to get on the move, man, but I seen a couple things, bro, and I'm just like, my, I just had to speak on it, bro. In my brain, I'm like, man, nah, Nike, ain't no way y'all gonna keep doing people like this, bro. But before I get into it, make sure you hit that like button, bro. We on the way to 600 subscribers, you feel me? We getting there, you know what I'm saying? We almost there, you feel me? We like, we, like, we a pinch away, you know what I'm saying? But hit that like button, man. Hit that subscribe button for your boy, you feel me? All right, let's get it. Basically, um, I noticed a trend, bro, with Nike and Nike sneakers, for real, for real. Not nothing else, just Nike sneakers, bro. You know what I'm saying? You ever go for a pair of shoes or you want to go for a pair of shoes and it got merch with it, you know what I'm saying? So you like, look, if I am going to hit the shoes, I'm going to go for the merch too. That way, I don't got to worry about, you feel me? Like, you're going to try to go for something, a t-shirt, something you know what i'm saying whatever the cheapest item is in a merch you're gonna go for it just so you have something to match the shoes well that's at least what i do i don't know what y'all be on you know what i'm saying maybe y'all just go for the shoes but i had a it, i had a period of time where i if i went for the merch and didn't get the merch but i went for the shoes and the merch at the same time i would get one or the other you know what i'm saying nowadays it seemed like if you go for the merch, you definitely not getting the shoes. So it's like, I don't know what Nike has done to sneakers, but stop releasing merch with shoes that we can't get. You know what I'm saying? Like, if we can't have the shoes, what makes you think I want a t-shirt with all these colors in it? What am I going to do with a t-shirt with orange, yellow, brown, purple, if nothing else you released has those colors like what am i supposed to do bro like y'all y'all really got to think about that bro don't put it like this don't make so much merch if you don't have the shoes to match you feel me don't nobody want to buy no shoes that don't go to nothing bro you got i'm sick of wearing white tees with shoes i'm sick of you feel me i'm sick of paying resale when you could have just let me get them both at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Now I gotta come out of extra 38 bucks for no reason. <laughs> for no reason. You know what I'm saying? I mean, y'all could just either make a couple more pairs, you feel know I me? Mean? Or realize that, hey, bro, this dude went for the merch. At least we should throw him a freaking bone. You know what I'm saying? Throw me a bone, cuz. Like, ain't no way I should be going for t shirts that don't match nothing. You feel know I me? Mean? Luckily, yesterday, the Mason Chateau Rouge 2s came out. And before, before they came out on sneakers, I'm like, all right, um, I don't think I'm gonna get no dub. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't feel a dub in my in my in my sneaker future. You know what I'm saying? So what I did was the day before they dropped, I got an instant pair from GOAT. You know what I'm saying? Review. Should be coming later today, cause they on the way. You hear what I'm saying? And to be completely honest, I'm glad I did, bro, cause I hit a t-shirt. Imagine you hit a t-shirt, bro, and can't get the shoes. Imagine this t-shirt being a specific color, yet your shoes, you don't get the shoes because, I don't know. Nike, what's up, bro? Like, at the, at, at the end of the day, man, nobody I know wants a t-shirt without the shoes you don't want shoes that match a specific item or specific items and you don't get the shoes you got t-shirts pants uh hoodies jackets you got a jacket that was like five six hundred bucks imagine you hit on that jacket and can't get the shoes you know what i'm saying imagine hitting on a jacket that's that much and you have nothing else but these shoes and nike just said you know what Nah, you don't want the shoes like that. Your submission wasn't selected. Why not? You selected me for the shirt, for the shoes. You selected me for the jacket, for the shoe. It just makes no sense, bro. Like, I don't understand that logic. I'll never understand that logic. You know what I'm saying? I just don't understand it. You know, I don't understand it. It's like, Nike is a shoe company. We're trying to keep customers that are here to buy shoes 
satisfied. You know what I'm saying? That's the goal. Why only? Why are we only making enough pairs for ten people to get them? Man, y'all are aware of, of bots. There's no type of bot protection. You can make as many accounts as you want. You know, you can go for as many pairs. Like you go for the same shoe from a hundred different accounts. Like literally, bro. Like y'all gotta figure out something. Make more shoes. Make a couple more, man. You know what I'm saying? Get a loyalty system going. I know it's a little weird, but a lot of people just made these accounts. A lot of these accounts is new. You know, most of these people are making accounts to try to get exclusive access knowing that Nike favors new accounts. That's kind of weird. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of weird. And the fact that y'all are aware of this and then just rolling on, you feel me? Just like, all right. Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Come on, Nike. Yeah, like, <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know if y'all seen these images, bro, but the I'm I'm in year twos, I mean twos, <laughs> the I'm I'm in year twelves will be releasing at some time this year, man. Official images, well, not official images. Mock-up pictures have been dropping, man, and he, this shoe is actually clean to me, man. A lot of people aren't fans of twelves, man, and not only am I a fan of twelves, but I have recently been a fan of these I'm on ear collabs. You know, I got one through three. You know, they already dropped one, two, and three. And I got all three pairs, two being the most recent. And it's just a clean colorway. You know, they always put it together clean. It's real subtle, man, real laid back. If you were to wear these sneakers with something, you know, a little more casual, you know what I'm saying? It wouldn't look so crazy. It wouldn't look so bad. You know what I'm saying? So. They are dropping the 12, man. It looks like they got two colorways of this 12. What y'all think, man? Let me know what y'all think of these 12s, man, because I'm personally a fan of 12s all across the board. I know people that haven't even owned a pair of 12s, don't like 12s. The Playoff 12s, which is a classic shoe, is still sitting. Like, I mean, you know, you go somewhere and get a pair of Playoff 12s, like, right now. You know what I'm saying? For the low. So it's like, 12s ain't everybody's favorite silhouette, but will they be available when it's time for me to cop a pair of 12s? You feel what I'm saying? Like, at the, at the end of the day, will y'all complain about this shoe now, and then when it come out, everybody got one, grabbing one, saying it's the shoe of the year? Like, that I don't like, bro. It's like, come on, man. Leave it for the people that actually like the shoe. Leave it for people that actually is a fan of the brand and of the 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 model of shoe. You know what I'm saying? I told y'all last video. If you didn't check my last video, I'll go check it out. You know what I'm saying? Shoes I never sell. Um, I'm a fan of 11s. 11s is my favorite model of Jordan. But if you were to ask me how many Jordans I had or which what amount of each one I had, I got a good amount of 12s. I got a good amount of 11s. I got a good amount of fives. These are shoes that I keep going to because I not like them. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, don't don't mess it up for people that really want the shoe. You know what I'm saying? I know we got a couple months, man, but sneaker sneaker people like to get out early and 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 you know throw a slander train on some shoes. But when it's time for them to drop, everybody want one. You know what I'm saying? Keep that same energy when it come to these, cause I need these. You know what I'm saying? I kind of thought they was gonna drop a, a, a four first. I kept seeing a, a mock-up of an of a Air Jordan 4 I'm on the air, and I like the four too. You know, I thought they were gonna keep going in order until they got to about seven or eight. You know, I thought they might've stopped at seven or eight or something, but it looks like they're skipping straight over all of them. So we gonna see, man. We gonna definitely find out, bro. I wanted to talk about one more thing. Nike, Nike pushing back releases. Um, I kind of feel like it's due to lack of purchasing. And hear me out. When I say that, it's not to say that Nike hasn't been selling out of shoes. What I'm saying is the shoes that they're expecting to sell out like last year are not doing so. So they have all these shoes that are sitting. They had a Nike sneakers reserve, like a Jordan reserve the other day. Chili Reds, uh, Midnight Navy, 72 and 10 lows. All them things sat. They all sat. Like full size runs of everything was sick. You know? After a while, they just started pulling them because nobody was buying them. So it's like, I feel like Nike knows what people want as far as the type of shoes. You know, they know they ain't gonna be able to get bricks off because people just thirsty for doves now because that's, that's over with. You know, we're not that thirsty for doves no more, Nike. We want the shoe we want. We don't want no shoes just to have shoes, you know? We want the shoe we want. Quit advertising us these shoes, putting them up, making it seem like 
they're up, they're accessible when we can't get to them. Most normal consumer can't get to them, you know. Bots, uh, multiple account hold, all that stuff, bro. Like, huh, you know what I'm saying? So I kind of feel like Nike done pushed everything back, trying to sell what they already have, but a lot of this stuff gonna end up at outlets. You know what I'm saying? So check your logo outlets coming soon, man, for 72 and 10s, chili reds, all this junk we ain't want, man. And somebody tell Nike, make more of the stuff we do want. Make sure a box can't get to it. You know what I'm saying? Make sure people can't take advantage of the system when real sneakerheads is trying to cop. You know what I'm saying? That's all. But yeah, man, it's been your boy Grish Kicks, bro. It don't cost you nothing to be real, man. I'll holler at y'all next time, man. Mason Chateau Rouge, review on the way. You feel me? All that, bro. Till next time, cuz. Yes, sir.